A beloved piece of local history has found a new home. The terrible trolley is now at the Pennsylvania Trolley Museum in Washington County. The streetcar was once owned and operated by the Port Authority of Allegheny County. Now, it was painted black and gold to celebrate the Steelers' four Super Bowl championships in the 1970s. This idea came from a nine-year-old girl named Kim Siever who wrote a letter to the then mayor, Richard Caligari. She suggested that the city paint a trolley to honor the team. Well, the mayor forwarded that letter to the Port Authority and a short time later, the terrible trolley was born. It was, this was a big deal. Uh, in the 1970s, Pittsburgh had lost a lot of jobs because the steel mill industry had closed in a lot of places. And the Steelers were doing great. They were winning Super Bowls and they brought a lot of hope to the city. So I think that this trolley is representative of that era. And we're really thrilled to be able to have it here. We just moved it here uh, last Wednesday. The streetcar was retired in 1988 and then rebuilt. It returned to service in 1989 and ran until 1998 when it retired for good. It was privately owned in Ohio for the past 25 years before the museum was able to acquire it and give it its new home. The vintage car will be repainted, black and gold of course, and be made operational again so it can eventually run on the four mile track operated by the museum.